What's up, my K says he is it's your girl. K says the Oracle, the biggest purr. And if you don't know, now you know. All right, it's your favorite, your favorite psychic code. Today we're running down the topic of what happened to Huey Ha Ha. Yeah, I don't know who this person is, but a lot of people have been talking about him um all on YouTube and shit like that. I'm not on TikTok and stuff like that. My Lanice wanted me to do this reading, so here we are. We're gonna figure out what happened to Huey Ha Ha. Um I feel like they're not releasing how he died, so maybe we can figure it out tonight. I don't know, but this is this is totally a request. Um, I'm pretty sure my subscribers won't even know who the hell this is, um, so that's why this is not on the Patreon. Um, so here we are. We're going to figure it all out, but first, first things first, we got to figure out who put up in the notification van, period, and who's driving. We got Mika versus Roman, girlie, so you know you get that free reading, and who in that passenger side? We got Talia Kersky, y'all always one and two, one and two. Then we got Myra Genix, she number three, she right in the back. Who else in the back with you, Myra Genix? Uh, We got Nada Beauty, we got Always Essence, we got Sir Nate Williams, we got Tiffany Bateshead, we got Mashe Johnson. Um, let me see who else, who else else, Miss Silky Black, we got Nicole Smith, we got Miss B787, um, we got Style Beauty 68, what's up, what's up, y'all all in the back, thanks for pulling up, I appreciate it, bump, bump, for your girl, all right, period, and when I say bump, bump, that's the like button, all right, so if you don't know, now you knew, you knew, period, so listen, let's get right into it, I ain't gonna stall you, I ain't gonna hold you, you hear me? Angels, ancestors, protect my energy. Put a fairy wall of protection around me, my home, my family, and fancy. Allow me to see and hear the messages clearly. Take my bias out of the reading. Angels, ancestors, I appreciate your love, guidance, wisdom, and protection. Also, put a fairy wall of protection around all my Kesesians, both new and old, and send them love and light for their highest good. Amen. Period. 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 All right, Mika, let me pull a deck to give you your free reading real quick. Whew. What I'm feeling. Let me see. We going to feature this Amira Salon deck right here. Pop, pop, pop. It's a double deck. Double deck, period. We working on that. We working on that. Let me see. Let me see. All right. I think all of this shit could be upside down. Let me see. Hold on. Damn it, Gina. Damn it, Gina. Some of these is upside down. What y'all been doing? What y'all been doing all evening? Y'all, I finally sent off the raffle merch to Iniko. She should be getting that in the next couple of days. I told her to take a picture so we can post it of her and her comfy, cozy case says merch. Period. Period. Dun, dun, dun. I don't know how these cards got upside down. Upside down. Let me turn these around real quick. I ain't going to be on her too long. You know what I'm saying? I ain't going to be on her too, 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 too long. Just real quick. Get this reading out the way. People keep talking about these dudes. My niece want to know. So I'm doing it for her. Cause Lord knows. I don't know who this person is. He looked like he was funny, though. To be honest. So angels, ancestors, give me some messages for uh, Mika, I forgot your, is it, what's your real name? Is it, is it Shamika Tamika? Uh, what's your real name? Is it? Uh, uh, uh. You said you took, you said took your reading last night and chewed it up. What that mean? What that mean, Kaka? Right, Tomika, I forgot. What did I say about you? Angels, ancestors. Ooh, you trying to bust it out? Bust it. Bust it. Bust it. Girl. So listen, something about communication, texting somebody, maybe somebody coming back from the past. I don't know. Do you know what I'm talking about? Look, communication, texting somebody from the past. I don't know. I don't know. Something involving work or something like that. I don't know. I don't know. Something about work is here. This could be that you you starting to put on your, yo, I don't know. You want to get more serious about business. I don't know. Or somebody like your business side or something like that. Or maybe you just about to buy more blazers. You want to just professionalize up your look or something like that. I don't know. 
Then we got some type of mature man. So what, some type of older man coming back? Are you like older men? Are you trying to attract the older, a little older sugar daddy or something like that? Is your dad all right? Is your grandpa all right? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But then there's something here about freedom. I don't know. So listen, somebody holding you back. You want to be free? What's going on? Free from what? Mentally, spiritually? Y'all want to know which, what's holding you back? You feeling like something holding you back from getting to your future or something like that? I don't know. Girly, what's up, Latrice? I don't know. That hurt. That hurt. So, girly, that's what I got for you. This bonus message is some type of gifts. Girl, you got a sugar daddy or something? The bottom of the deck is some type of gifts. You got a sugar daddy? Let me hold something. What the hell? You got some type of sugar daddy with some gifts, some freedom, some something going on right here. Maybe the sugar daddy, you put it on them too hard or something like that. God damn me. He trying to give you the gifts to come back. You're like, I don't know. I don't know. What's going on, girl? You said you definitely free now. All right, girly. Free to move about the cabin. Okay. Is that how free you are? Is that how free you are, girl? You just got to have a relationship or something? I don't know, girl. But that's your reading. That's what's coming up in your energy. There you go. All right, girl. Let me see. Um, so what's going on with Huey? Ha ha. I don't know. Angels, ancestors. First things first, I feel like they're not. He died at 22. That's the kind of like the weird thing. Then it's like they're not really saying how he died. So let's probably just figure that out. Angels, ancestors. How did Huey? Ha ha. Die. How did Huey? Ha ha. Die. How did Huey? Ha ha. Die. Uh, excuse me. How did he die? Oh, I don't know about this. I don't know about this. I don't know, cuz. First, we got the world card. Then we got the five of cups. Then we got the ace of swords. Then we got the three of cups. And then we got this devil card. So, she, I don't, I don't know. how. Let's figure it out. Let's figure it out. I don't know. This might get a little complicated. I feel like people do want to know, like, what, it, you know, like, maybe what happened to him. Because they're not saying it. I don't know. So let's figure it out. Okay. Okay. The world card. Ending and beginning. Number 21. Major Arcana. Let's figure it out. This only for the people that really want to, you know what I'm saying? No, because somebody, who he, a lot of people don't know who this is. It's not really probably for my subscribers because I'm pretty sure y'all don't know who he is. But like I said, this is for the people that do want to know. Um, Let me see. Damn. Some type of ecstasy, some type of drugs. It's a pill, OD on some type of pill. I don't know if I'm getting something like a overheating, overheating, like something feels like hot, something feels like throw up, breathing hot, something, something feel like chest burning, something like that. I don't know. Interesting. Okay. Huh. I'm getting something like an energy that it was a peaceful death, which means that, like he kind of just like floated off. I don't know if if it was just an overheating, he was like throwing up, but it's like it seemed like it maybe wasn't all that traumatic. Uh is what I'm getting. I don't know if they'll say that something happened to him that's traumatic, but I feel like um, the impression I'm getting is that it was like no suffering involved, like whatever it is. It seemed like it was pretty quick. Something about, I'm feeling like this was faded. Like this was the end of his cycle. This is what he was supposed to do. This is faded. Whatever happened, um, it was faded. Okay. Um, okay. So we, we can keep going. Five of cups. Five of Cups is like a regret energy, right? Let's see why that's here, though. Five represents changes. Boo, boo, boo. Okay, so this, this is like acknowledging that his death left, so left behind two people. Two people. I don't know if other people died with him. 
I don't know if he died in some type of like it, something feels like a throw up. He drunk something or something. Something feels like a spilling. I don't know what spilled. It could be blood that spilled. I don't know if there was some type of motivation was robbery or something like that. Um, I don't know if he was in a group of five and three people got shot. Two people didn't like something, something like that. I don't know. Um, I don't know. There was some type of betrayal involved some way, shape, form or fashion. I don't know from who, from what or what. Um, mm. I don't know if his girlfriend just had a miscarriage or, 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 or we have a miscarriage or I don't know if he had another kid on the way or something like that. I don't, I don't know. I think they said he only had one daughter, but listen, I don't just going with the energy. So I don't listen. I don't know. Um, Yeah, but somebody feel bitter or resentful about his passing or something like that. Um, there's some type of woman energy, though. Okay. Okay, so then we have the Ace of Swords. Because I said, how did he die? And we're getting all of this stuff. I don't know how it fits in, but let's just keep going. Um... They're talking about him being at the beginnings of success. Um, something good will happen from his death or something like that is here. Um, hmm. There was some type of conflict going on. So I don't know if this is just saying that he tried to handle some type of conflict. He felt through his own logic, but in actuality, he should have involved the police. I feel like I don't know what this, I don't know what this is or what this could be, though. Okay, then we get the three of cups. I don't know if he was at a party. Something feels like a party, a gathering, a get together of some sort when this all went down. Again, I feel like, I don't know if something was, I don't know, something feels like, I don't know if he was thirsty, he was something about a choking, a drinking, something involves like ingesting something though, okay? Something like that is involved. I don't know if they'll say that on the news, but that's what I'm getting. Um... Yeah, I feel like he was at a party type setting. I don't know if he really wasn't supposed to go to that party or he was like it was a last minute thing or something. I don't know. Some type of energy like that is here, too. Um I feel like they seen like comedy and entertaining people was a hobby, but that wasn't his profession. I don't know what that truly means, but I guess we'll ask more questions if need be. Then we have the devil energy here. How did he die? This is getting, I don't know. What's, what's going on? Mm, 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 Why is this devil energy here? Something is like a, a unbalanced of something. Um, unbalanced something. Um, it's like something about like his his mental state led him to make bad decisions or. I don't know. Something like that. Um, he has some personal demons that he needed to deal with. Um, I do feel like some there was some type of addiction here. Something had him in a vice. Mm. 
Yeah, I don't know if it's, it's like sex. I just feel like I feel like it's just a I'm seeing like a lot of just sex and drugs and party and money and drinking, like just being 22, though. But it feels like to the excess. Um, all right, let's clarify with some cards. All right, so those are some some impressions I'm getting. Let's see what y'all talking about. You feel like the poison was something in his drink? Mm. Okay, let's see. Girl. What's up, Ortiz Lapsley? What's up, Tracy Ganville, Native Beauty? What's up, Latrice Dobbins? All right. So why is this world card here, angels? Why is the world card here? Oh, deceit about something. Second chakra, uh, root chakra. That's my root. That's uh, solar plexus, right? Am I not mistaken? 36. Deep. Yeah, it's some type of deceit from somebody around him, though. I am getting it. I don't know that he also thought that his creativity was blocked and he had to take these drugs to, to make him be creative and be funny or something like that. I don't know. Um... But this is definitely like a create, like a creativity, a, in, a, a energy, uh, and, and intimacy center and chakra. Okay, that second chakra. But then it's clarified by deceit. So deceit, <clears throat> deceit can be a few things. Don't, 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 don't. Let me see if we can gather more details. Cause shit, I don't. So this is somebody either personally or professionally. Somebody spreading rumors. Then that's probably where this Ace of Swords came from. I don't know if he went to confront somebody at a party about some shit that he heard that somebody was saying about him or something like that. But I don't know if somebody uh, cashed him in. Something feels like a cash token. Like somebody cashed him in or something like that. And this was also something that he was lying to himself about. About maybe taking these drugs for creativity or something like that. Yeah, this is a bit of uh, outside deceit and self-deceit. Okay, then we have the Five of Cups. Let's clarify that. Why is this Five of Cups here? Goddess of the Moon. See, I knew it had some feminine energy around that five of cups and she just popped out. So this woman that's popping up around his energy may be a water sign. She could be a cancer. Uh, she could be a Pisces, uh, something like that. She definitely has a lot of water in her chart. It feels like a cancer woman, though. OK, why is this Ace of Swords here? Mm -mm 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 -mm. Why is this Ace of Swords here? See, attachments and yin, yin, yang. I swear to God, bruh. Did we not already sell the, say these words? That attachment word came up with the devil energy. And here you go again, bruh. She be on point. Period. Okay. Yin, yin, yang. His balance was off with shit. Okay. Period. Bruh. And then he was, I don't know if, again, this is some type of correcting some type of, of balance or something like that, trying to balance something out. But it feels like it was an overcorrecting. 
energy. This is deep. Why is the three of cups here? Why is the three of cups here, angels? Why is the three of cups here? Man holding a coin. But this is like a pill. This may not be a coin, but it's like, hey, once somebody take, once he take this pill, then somebody going to cash him in like a coin. That's what I'm getting. Period. At this motherfucking party setting. It's the perfect place. Somebody, this feels like it could have been a plan though. <sighs> mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. Let me see. Why is this devil card here? Why is this devil card here? The thinking man. Somebody was uh thinking man. Let me see. That could be just. Like, I don't know if this is just like thinking about a decision, but still doing the wrong thing or just being all in your head, like negative shit in your fucking head, overthinking. You know what I mean? Overthinking is, is bad. You know what I mean? Because you can't overthinking. You just running yourself into thoughts and you creating scenarios in your head that's not even there. And you run up all these motherfucking calculations. And if you all in your head, then you not in the moment. Right. Also, with this energy is like. Like, like Huey Ha Ha could have been with this man was holding. Do you see what I'm saying? And somebody was thinking about cashing him in like a cash token. That's what I'm hearing still, though. Legit. Then, mm, I don't know. That's what I'm getting, though, so far. So, 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 so far, this looks like some type of setup. Don't, don't, don't. They put a pill in his drink. He said he was in a gang. Let's ask a couple of less uh yes or no questions. Fancy, you want to say hi? You want to say hi? What's up? You want to say hi? Fancy, you want to say hi, y'all? Who here? Is somebody here? Is somebody here? What the fuck you looking up for? You know, I don't see shit. I don't I don't have that gift of seeing. You see somebody? What? Who you see? What? You see somebody? Quit playing. What? Girl, get down. That spooky shit. What's up, Lorenzo? So let's ask some shit, all right? So let's ask some yes or no questions. Angels, ancestors. Was Huey Ha Ha in a gang? Was he in a gang? Was Huey Ha Ha in a gang? Dun, dun, dun. Why do... Um... Y'all, yeah, I... I don't know if I don't, I don't really, I'm not really seeing gang. I'm not really seeing gang. Um, um, I think basically, yeah, but it wasn't like no hardcore shit. Like, you know what I mean? Like, like, cause I'm not getting no definite, like, yeah, he was in the game. I feel like it was like an association and it feel like a hardcore gang something. Something don't feel like hardcore gang banging like he and this motherfucker like she. What's up, cook, cook? What's up, fofo? -fo? Like, I don't see no shit like that, but just like associations. You know what I mean? Like, environmental associations. A means of getting money. Um, networking. You know what I mean? Um, interesting, interesting, interesting. Interesting, interesting. Ortiz Lapsley, what you saying? He was from the hood. He been through a lot. You can see some of his videos. He tried to hide it with the comedy. Mm, mm, mm. Angels, ancestors. Um, let me see. Was he dealing drugs? Was Huey Ha Ha dealing drugs? Was he dealing drugs? I'm getting a yes. But it's like not not like a, a large amount because I mean we don't have the exclamation mark. Um, there's there was some drug dealing. Okay, there was some drug dealing, but nothing too crazy though. Nothing too crazy, but there was some drug dealing. Um, angels, ancestors, was he sacrificed? Was he sacrificed? Was he sacrificed? Was there some type of... Uh, was he sacrificed? Was he sacrificed? Mm, I'm going to ask a question in my head. Let me see if I'm right. So I asked, was he sacrificed to the goddess Hekete? 
Hecate, Hecate is H E uh H E C A T E Hecate, something like that. But I asked that in my head, and this is the answer that I got. Okay. Um hmm. they said that Kobe Bryant was sacrificed to her too. Very interesting. Um hmm. I don't know what to ask after that. Interesting. Hmm. Angel's ancestors. Did he sell his soul? Did he sell his soul? I got the if you believe card. Eggs help from others. Take action. Big happy changes. Not the right time. Bottom of the deck is helpful people. So I don't know if there's other people around him that did what he did that did. But I don't know if he, I feel like he was holding it off. Like, you know what I mean? I don't know. I feel like he was holding it off. I feel like if he had more time, I feel like maybe he would have due to peer pressure or something like that um, to maybe like provide for his family more as a whole. Um, but I'm not saying that he really sold his soul, but he was sacrificed under some type of Hekete ritual. Yeah, that is true, Talia. That is true. Oh, Angel's ancestors, did they put a pill in his drink? 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 I think he, okay, so they definitely did put a pill in the drink. Definitely did put a pill in the drink. But something about like, Something about he he refused it or he was refusing or tried to refuse it or something like that. Uh, um, I don't know the whole peel the drugs is the outlet. You know what I mean? I'm like, I feel like they may say that eventually on the news. They always go to drugs and people just be like, oh, he's 22 drugs. It makes sense. Right. But something to me just feels like it's a little bit more than that. It's a little bit more to that. A little bit more to that. Because I feel like I saw something spilled. Like, it, I feel like I saw blood spilled. Or something like a pool of something. This is very, very, very deep, okay? Um... I'm going to ask a different question. Angel's ancestors, was he initiated? Was he initiated? Was he initiated? The abundance card came out. The trust the process card came out. If you believe. So there's something better. Mm, interesting. He was a part of something, though. Definitely. Because we asked about a gang, and it was like, uh, yeah, a gang, but like maybe not in the quintessential. That's why I said not in the way we think in like a gang bang. Like we, I'm not seeing nothing like that, like the quintessential gang banger and all of that type of shit. I'm not seeing that. It was some, uh, it's something other than that. But it is something that in, that he did for money, though, and that he was gonna continue to do because it was bringing in abundance. For his family. Rashara will say something. You hear me? What you pull up for and you going to say? You said you want to know why the rapper is paying for his funeral. You should start there. What rapper? Girl, because I don't know who he is. So, I mean, if you're going to pull up, help out. Because I don't know who this person is. I'm doing this because my niece asked me to do this. So, if you got anything to lend to the case, you need to she is speak now for a whole yo. Pizzies, you hear me? Because the last time somebody said, oh, the rapper Mozzie said he was going to pay for dude's funeral. Then they said that his GoFundMe raised 33000 So shit, is it the GoFundMe? God damn me. So Angel's ancestors, uh, I mean, because I don't know where y'all getting at. Or y'all wanted me to ask, did like this rapper Mozzie uh, sacrifice him? Like, is that what y'all wanted me to ask? Angel's ancestors did Mozzie sacrifice um, Huey Haha. -Ha. Did Mozzie sacrifice Huey Haha? -Ha. Yeah, I get an unlikely and let go. 
I get an unlikely and let go. Okay, so yeah. I get an unlikely and let go. I'm going to ask one more time, though. Angels, ancestors did. The rapper Mozzie sacrificed Huey Ha Ha. I feel like eventually, I feel like something about like he's gonna take like take credit or take something like okay, so this is what this is where this is coming in. Why this why this yes card is in the future because like his name will be attached because if he stands up like y'all saying because I don't even know this dude. So if he but he could be known by attaching himself to the death like oh he's so noble he paid for his funeral and then let somehow thrust this guy into like stardom if you will because i don't even i've never even heard of no motherfucking mozzie i'm not on tiktok and whatever um so i'm getting that energy but it doesn't feel like a um a sacker like a like he sacrificed him type energy just that he more like it was strategic for him to ride the coattails uh, publicity wise of his death, so then people could start asking, Well, who is this Mozzie guy that stepped up and paid for Huey Ha Ha's funeral? Do you see what I'm saying? You say, Well, you heard that they are sacrificing TikTok stars and Instagram stars. Well, shit, why wouldn't they? Because again, y'all, the word influencer, again, these people are pushing agendas to us, the sheeple, as they call us, okay. So listen, once they done with you, are you not pushing that agenda or you, you, I don't know, you know what I mean? If you need to be sacrificed, if your numbers line up to be sacrificed, they'll take your ass out and sacrifice your ass. But again, when you sign up to play that game at that level like that, you're agreeing to be used to influence us to play in the campaign of the elite. Do you like, is it, y'all gotta see that, right? Y'all gotta see that. Rashara said they don't want to sign a contract. Right, because just like that video a long time ago with uh, what's his face? I mean, what's her face, Sukihana? Well, she was saying she signed a contract, but she didn't realize she was signing herself up to work to the devil, work for the devil. You know what I mean? Work on behalf of the devil and his agenda. Okay. Doom, doom, doom. So, yeah, I'm getting these energies. All of these energies is the same. Yeah, all of our energies is the same about this. That's what's coming out. Yeah, this is close enough. You hear me? This is this is this is enough, girl. Now nah, I'm gonna skip that. Uh, Ortiz Lapsley says Mozzie said because dude was from around the same area or associated. That's why he was going to do it. Well, again, he can pick whatever agenda he choose to, but it's to make him look good. You see what I'm saying? Because before, because I just, it's, I, I just checked the whatever was going on around his story, and then they, they didn't say shit about no motherfucking name, Mozzie. You see what I'm saying? Now he didn't attach his name to it. They just said that he raised his GoFundMe via Inside Edition. They got nine million motherfucking sheep who following that goddamn thing on, on uh YouTube, and they didn't say shit about no damn. But then this this is also to come up. Whoever controls uh that damn uh GoFundMe, whoever gets them in, they come up on it too. But they all of those people are in on it. Do you see what I'm saying? Because they about to come up via motherfucker. I stupid ass is being like, oh, I feel so bad for him and his daughter and shit. Let me send him some money. They already bank off that. That's what I'm saying, y'all. Sometimes, uh. I just feel like we was we conditioned to just curse and just just be too emotional about shit. I feel like we sometimes just override logic with oh, you know what I'm saying? We just get so roped them into some sad story type shit. Like damn, quit falling for shit. Quit falling for shit. Damn, y'all sending y'all money to these motherfuckers to his damn GoFundMe and shit because he got his he got a picture up there with his daughter and all of that shit just to draw in sympathy for y'all and all of that not to say that he didn't love his daughter or nothing like that but I'm saying the aftermath of some setup shit that they did they trying to be garner sympathy for this person using these certain images in a certain narrative that's all I'm saying
Mm, 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 mm. Uh, let me see. You said that's the same thing with the other TikTok with Shah. He was going to sign something, but he changed his mind. That's deep, Nada Beauty. See, I don't know because I don't keep up with all of this shit. Um, Mika versus Roman said they are. I had to deal with some clown following me on TikTok, and I'm not even popular, and they gang stalking people right now if you speak up against their agenda. Ooh, that gang stalking shit is real, huh? Yeah, I don't even know who the fuck Mozzie is, all right? Very, very, very interesting. What do you think about the little boy that got raped with that screw? With a screw? Y'all, see, listen, I don't want to... I'm not even finna lend my energy to certain shit, okay? You saw some, do I believe the story or do you think it's a humiliation ritual? Um, yeah, I, I, I don't fucking know. Uh, I don't even want to talk about that shit because that's not even what we're talking about. That's for some current events type shit. I, ugh. Anyway, um, but that's 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 really what we getting about this Huey Ha Ha story. Uh, you know, uh, stay tuned. That's but that's what I'm getting though. Um, this was more like a murder, and I feel like they're gonna say he OD'd or some type of drug or some type of pill, and say that he was dealing with some type of addiction. Or I don't fucking know, but this feels like a murder. Cause I keep feeling like something with. Chest swallowing, throw up. I, I mean, I, I don't know if he. I, I feel like I see his mouth with blood. I don't know. I don't know. <sighs> mm -mm. Well, we're gonna go ahead and end off this reading right here, though, and get on up out of here. Um, thanks for y'all for pulling up, watching the video. If you know somebody that want to see maybe a little bit into what happened to him. If they need for closure, feel free to share the video, okay? Well, guys, I'm out of here. Like I always say, seek the truth, vibrate higher, and carpe diem. Until the next time, she, we out.